Hello, what's going on guys? Esco here. Welcome back to the Unity Original Sin 2. Um, yeah, so we have two large battles waiting for us. So one is over here, over here, and the other one is over here up on the pier. So I want to try something to see if I can make it work. But basically I need to wait for this guy to uh, get back. One thing that I should mention, the Red Prince now doesn't have a shield and he has a buttload of uh, offensive abilities which might prove useful. And I don't know if I did mention this previously but I also organized my spell bar. So let's get this guy to be over here. Okay. So I think I, I can cheese this fight a little bit. Okay. Um, so let's bring in Losa. And let's bring in the Red Prince. The Fane, sorry. Okay, and the other thing that I wanted to do, so I got this Electric Infusion, which makes uh, our normal Incarnate into an Electric Incarnate. Mm, there we go. So this just gives us uh, basically options to change how the incarnate is working mid-fight which is always nice yeah you see he immediately got the damn and let's try the red prince's new ability which is bullhorns So with this, he can just, I believe, go here. Okay, and... Hmm. How much damage do I do? I think I can just cripple him immediately. Nice. I think he cannot move at this point. So, let's just... Uh... I think he's already shocked, or she's already shocked. So I can just stun her. There we go, and Fane can just... Come on, target her. Okay. So trivialize the next fight a little bit. Nice. What? No loot? Really? Okay, so let's see one thing. Goodbye. So there's two guys over here. And this is an archer. Hold on. Hold on. What are these guys here? So these guys, so that this is one archer, okay, so I think I will go from this side, um, yeah, let's, uh, let's just circumnavigate this and go from the courtyard, and hopefully our dude doesn't die. Yeah, let's just save, I don't know if that guy is useful in the future but so I need nails I didn't I forgot that I can uh, get up here hmm yeah let's just take this Let's 
Rare scraps, okay. Read this. Is there anything interesting? No. Read this. Anything interesting? No. Okay. Okay. And I think I can just get into battle. He just got into into a fight. Ricochet. Ah, uh, okay. So let's see. Prepare yourself. So first things first. This archer needs to get uh, crushed. So I think I will just yet again create. Uh, yeah, a magic incarnate. Hopefully the dude doesn't die. Okay. Electric confusion. No, I don't want to haste her. Yeah, so I think the incarnate is becoming pretty powerful. Nice. Good, decent. Subdue them. And make sure Cork doesn't leave. Oh, this is Paul in Cork, eh? I just hope this dude doesn't die. Oh, he has he has decent amount of health. No worries. No worries at all. I'm sure. So one interesting thing that I now have for the Red Prince is the ability to fly. So I can just do this. And Mosian over here. There we go. So let's cast the bulls, the horns, just in case. How much did this guy have? 32. I can atrophy him and it should be all good. There we go. This guy is pretty, pretty bare bones at this point. Uh, let's cast Encourage, and you know what, the Red Prince might take some beating, so I will just move Loso over here, and cast Uncanny Evasion. So Uncanny Evasion is just something that will make it so that uh, enemies will miss uh, all the time. Wait, Fane isn't in battle, right? No. He is in battle. Fuck, man. Okay. Bleeding? Hold on. This does not stun. Oh, man. Okay. Do this knockdown. Okay. Let's stun her. And I think I can just start hitting this guy. It should be okay. Nice. <laughs> they kicked his ass. <laughs> nice. Oh, he's out to get me. Okay, dude. Let's see what you're made of. This does not worry me. Uh, you know what? Screw this guy. Let's put him over here. 
So the archer will most likely die. There we go. Okay, so it's Sibyl's turn now. Oh! I teleported to Sibyl. Uh, okay. That's what was wrong. Fuck. Okay, fine. Let's teleport him over here. Oh, there's one more archer. Okay. I see. Okay, Fane. Let's teleport you... Fuck. Teleport you nowhere, I guess. Please let me teleport him up top. Nice. Okay. So let's see. I can attack him, but that's not a problem. Let's attack this guy. Magic armor? What? Kick his ass. Okay. Nice, nice, nice. You just keep doing that. I can't remember why this guy was important, but sure. Mm, yeah, let's just cripple him. So he can't run away. Three action points. Uh, four, okay. Let's help this guy. I want to start working on the archer, but for now I don't think I can do that. I need to save this guy. Lest he dies. Mm, okay, let's get Losa over here. And I can give him some armor. There we go. Nice and safe. So this is Sibyl. Uh, I don't think I need to do anything, so... Uh, I don't even need the cat, but... Let's do this. So, is this oil? Yeah, okay. And let's try the cat out. Oh, you can only have one summon. Oh, that sucks. Huh? I cannot attack? Oh wow. I just screwed up big time. Oh man did I screw up. Okay, this guy is almost dead. There we go. Nice. And because Fane now has a heal ability, let's heal Cork. There we go. Oh man. So it's useless to get to you to try and use the cat. Uh, I think I can just fly over there. Uh, 
I'll just leave uh, this dude to be handled from someone else. <laughs> oh, I hit him. Mm. Cork? Pretty long range battle. Let's slow this guy a little bit. Oh man. Uh, let's delay. Hopefully I can get the cat in a more decent place. I need two action points to move the cat. Move it over here. And swap with Sibyl. What? Oh, this sucks, man. Oh, the cat sucks. Is this only on the incarnate? Yeah, it's only for the incarnate. Oh, man. Why not? Well, I'm disappointed at this point. Let's just kill the archer. Ah, uh, the archer is still going. Four action points. Ch -ch 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 -ch. Uh, let's delay with Fane then. She's running away. Not doing anything. Okay. Let's stun the stupid archer. Jesus, dude. Let's get as far as possible. Well, this was a pretty stupid fight, I might say. Stupid cat. Doesn't do anything. Oh, I wanted to... Fuck, man. I wanted to move Fane. With uh, some teleport, but... No, I guess I didn't do that. Oh, well. Four action points? What? He slowed down. That's why. What you doing, mate? Glory is mine. By Lucian's swords, these magisters are mad. You are right. I am alright, I just saved your ass. I'm glad to hear it. It was good to have you on my side. We showed those maniacs what's what, eh? 
Mm -hmm. He pauses a moment to wipe a thick mixture of sweat and blood from his brow before continuing. I still can't believe they had the gall to attack me. It's high treason to go after a paladin like that. We're divine order, gods damn it. Our superiors will be very oh. interested to hear this. Our yeah. Grand Master, for one. Lord Ken would never stand for this kind of nonsense. The thing is, people on the mainland don't know what goes on here. Never would have believed it myself until I saw it with my own eyes. But we've stood about talking long enough. And this place is no roadside tavern. It's certain death if we keep lingering. Okay. First Where things we'll first. I need to get the lay of the land inside Fort Joy. I was sent here to make an official report on what exactly goes on here. I don't intend to run away now. Okay. After that, though, and without the Magister's help, there's nowhere to go but the Hollow Marshes. They say they're haunted, but I don't believe in bogeymen. Bogeymen? Not bogeymen, bogey. I was once told there's an old harbor on the far side of the island. And where there's a harbor, there may be a boat. Okay. I must be off, and so should you. Best of luck to you. You deserve better than this place. Oh, so what? He's telling you of an alternative way to exit? Yeah, escape from your Versailles. Yo, well, sir. Okay, let's see what I can loot. Fire arrow. Sending to fame. Getting all of the gold. Oops, sorry. Ah, uh, sure. Junk. Ooh, hello. What are you doing? Dual wielding plus one. Meh. Okay. Two apples. Nails on the shelf. Sharp piece of metal. Okay. So you have a couple of things that I want to do, but yeah, you can see that even here there's a whole bunch of people. Uh, excuse me one second. Sorry about that. Uh, what was I saying? Yes, as you can see, there's a bunch of people even here and I will need to fight, well, everything. Claw hammer, sec. Oh, okay. I might get get some interesting things. Pongs and claw hammer. Lock picks. Probably don't need that. Nope. Ah, I can just press X. Okay. <laughs> so, just a whole bunch of spoons. Uh, okay. <laughs> What's with all of this carpenter stuff? Ooh, Captain Tipple's key. To fit the gates lock, okay. Okay. So this is nice, I might... I'll send this to, basically. Plus one telekinesis, okay. One of my spellcasters can use this. So, let's see. This is open or not? Okay. Uh, I want to see what the Red Prince has for the weapon. So, 15 to 16. Automatically, this is better, I believe. Yeah, 12 to 14. This hammer is 15 to 16. So, it's better to just use this. Oh, come on, dude. Hold on. Okay. Pitchfork, spear. Yeah, I'm not going to loot everything. 
Oh, Jesus. Okay. So there's one thing that I can do over here. I think I need to pick this lock. Really? Why is Fane so far away? Okay, never mind. I want to pick lock. He should have enough thievery. There we go. Reinforced crate. Leather scraps and physical armor. Is there anything else that there might be inside? There is a chest. I think the Red Prince needs to lift this. No, not the door. The crate. There we go. I want to move this over here somewhere. Come on, do it. There we go. Plate, useless, useless but free, sell it. Anything here? There is. But how can I get it? Do I need telekinesis? Hold on. Uh, let's see. Uh, Losa might be able to use this. Uh, the gloves that she's wearing are just two physical armor, so automatically she will use this, these. Um, no. Let's get the sack. Move it. Yeah, the good thing about telekinesis is that I can move stuff from further away. Come on. Sure, let's move it here. A potato. Really? <sighs> Fine. I saw this chest, I want to loot it. Absolutely Frank, not. Do seek my counsel. No. I don't want to talk to you right now. So there should be a guard over here, I believe. Magister's leather armor. Huh. Not really too good, I might say. So there should have been one dude over here. I guess not. Okay. I guess I would at this place. So I I did not open this. Hello. Okay, so I will equip my guys and I will continue off in the next episode where I will start the fight immediately with these guys that are after this door right in front of me. So thanks so much for watching, hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you next time. Bye!